Hi guys, my name is Stan and today is day 7th of my 30 days video making challenge and today I am making egg curry While the egg is boiling, I will start my cooking process so I have heated a pot in which I will be adding oil. This is around 2 tablespoons of oil. Alright, so once the oil is heated, I will add in the dried spices, garam masala. So I will add in 2 cloves, cinnamon sticks, peppercorns and one black cardamom. and one bay leaf. I'll let this simmer and now I'll add in finely chopped onions. I've taken around two medium sized onion and I've chopped them fine. Now we'll fry this onion till it turns brown. We will keep we will keep the flame slow, okay, so that the onions fry well. Okay, now this will take some time, okay. So make sure that you fry the onions well, and uh, we need the egg curry gravy to be thick, and it should be a nice smooth paste. So fry the onions well. Alright, so the onions have started to get brown. At this point, I will add in ginger garlic paste. Around a teaspoon of ginger garlic paste is what I'll add. And we'll just fry this ginger garlic paste well so that it uh, the, the rawness of the ginger garlic paste is disappeared. So the onions are fried just the way I wanted and now I will add in two medium sized finely chopped tomatoes. So the onions and the tomatoes are fried well, okay, we need to fry it more, okay, but before we do that, I'll add in the masalas. One teaspoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder, half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, 1 teaspoon of coriander powder and half a teaspoon of jeera powder. And we'll mix it well. So as you can see the masala is kind of drying up. Okay, so I'll add in little water. We don't want the masala to burn down so if you feel that the masala is drying up 
keep adding little water can you see the consistency it's getting like a paste so we will keep frying it okay so the masala is fried well okay and at this point what you can do is if you want it in a thick gravy form you can just add little or uh, little water okay but here in my case i'll be eating it with rice so i'll just have this in a gravy form so i'll be adding 1 to 2 cups of water now i'll let this boil and i'll add my eggs to this so some people they fry the boiled eggs but i don't like frying them so i just use it as it is at this stage what i do is while the gravy is boiling i'll break one egg into it and i'll let it boil for 5 minutes more and then i'll turn off the flame okay so it's been 5 minutes now that i have boiled this curry it's cooked well i will turn off the flame and i will garnish this with some coriander leaves that's about it the egg recipe is all done i will serve it in a dish i will eat it with rice and uh, this is one of my favorite recipes that i make if you like this video please do hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you have and stay tuned to stand by